Sabatas Numer Sayyid, who has cracked his gate examination in his third year itself with AIR 148. Congratulations, Numer. Thank you so much. How are you feeling today? I am feeling great. I am feeling very satisfied. It is. Uh, it finally feels very good to see your uh, year-long input uh, convert into numbers and such good, decent numbers. Everyone at home, in classes, and myself, we are all very happy. Thank you for asking. Uh, when and why did you decide to appear for GATE? I joined classes in October 2022, and uh, when I was in my second year of engineering. Uh, but my preparation actually started in February 2023. After I saw our seniors uh, give and uh, appear and uh, uh, talk about their examinations. So that's when my preparation started. That's great. When you first started preparing for GATE, did you decide that you were going to crack GATE in your third year itself? No. So when I joined classes, my first uh, my primary objective to join classes was to polish my subjects and my understanding in the core CS subjects. But uh, after coming here, after attending a few classes and getting comfortable with Sir, Professor RSV, uh, he actually suggested that I should consider this as my final attempt as, uh, as a do or die situation. And he also suggested that he himself gave uh, gate in third year and scored good marks so according to his advice i preferred giving it this year and i actually prepared for it very uh, thoroughly so it was uh, sir's uh, uh, suggestion for me to uh, pursue it thoroughly in third year only that's amazing um, how did you keep yourself focused and avoid distractions I would say uh, distractions were effective when uh, it uh, when they were uh, you know when they were acted on you for a very long time. So it wasn't the case for me. We were through. We were within our preparation for a very long time, and both both हम लोग कम कम time frame में मिलते रहते थे. So every time you meet your peers and sir. Every time you know your place, you get humbled every time you meet people. There are people smarter than you. There are people performing better than you. And uh, if you have finally decided to uh, come and uh, compete in this competitive environment. So after uh, taking a tough toll all day, uh, being in a class full of toppers and scholars, people smarter than you, uh, it gets very hard to be distracted by such distractions when you have a goal in mind and you have to work for it. So, I guess peers and uh, the curriculum that is taught in this class is very important. It was very important for keeping me away from distractions. The motivation was so uh, tight that I, I, I was, it was very easy for me to avoid distractions. Yes. That's great. Uh, my next question is, how did you manage game preparation along with college? I made sure that my attendance was above uh, above or uh, at border of the the 75 percent mark which is required in our colleges uh, by this uh, for this i tried talking to my college teachers who were pretty understanding and uh, i used to attend even lectures and uh, practicals and i used to solve pyq sometimes sometimes if i had a long time frame i used to give tests two hour long one hour long tests we had uh, so, yes, I made sure that there were no remarks from college as uh, it is also important. But my main priority was GATE. So, I had to prioritize it before college. So, yes, that's how I managed. That's great advice. I'm sure it will help a lot of candidates. Uh, when did you start appearing for tests and what was your approach? We started giving tests in uh, end, end, end of June and the starting of July, I guess, if I remember correctly. Uh, my first impression for, for test paper, uh, with test papers were the previous year question papers, which, uh, which were 2022, 2023, 2021 and so on, back forth. So we used to give tests which I felt comfortable with to get used to the three hour long 
session of writing a paper, maintaining composure and uh, same speed and accuracy. And uh, also revising the previous year questions alongside. Uh, at the end of July, uh, uh, sorry, at the end of June and starting of July, we started with question uh, test papers. And uh, until the exam was uh, conducted, we were constantly giving tests. How did you keep yourself motivated when you scored less than tests? So, uh, the test paper marks are actually not pretty uh, important because uh, when we start giving tests, shuru mein kami marks aate hain aur hum log matlab jaisa hum logon ne jab fresh test dena chalu kiya to hamare jo concepts hote hain wo bahut kahin kahin shallow covered hote hain kahin pe bahut deep covered hote hain aur to in gaps ko bharna bahut zaruri hai to jab marks kam aate hain so you know where you lack so every time you get less marks you have to understand where you lose the marks so the marking and uh, the picking of questions is very important from those low uh, scored tests so aur sir ne bhi humko bataya ke usko see, usse seekhna kaise usse analysis kaise karna hai aur usko usse better kaise karna hai apne aap ko to less marks were not really that big of a matter for us so in the end marks apne aap decent hone lage when we filled the gaps with the help of everyone around us so yes that's it that's great uh, what was your preparation strategy during the last month before gate we were uh, told to focus on the pyqs and uh, basically humko jo pyqs mein gaps milte the in fact wo last iteration tha hamara pyq ka hum we go through series of iterations of the uh, questions and uh, concepts and pyqs as well to wo hamara last attempt tha to hame actually mein last mein bahut cherry picking karke concepts padhna padta tha aakhri month mein to humne sare pyqs wapas se diye aur uh, finally jo gaps bache the wo humne aakhri mein cover kiya sir ne bhi aakhri mein apna bahut time diya aur uh, peers jo hamare hain unhone bhi bahut sara time diya और हम क्वेश्चन के पेपर के बाद आपस में डिस्कस करते थे क्वेश्चन और कॉन्सेप्ट जिससे चीजें बेटर हुई थैंक यू फाइनली व्हाट सजेशंस और एडवाइस वुड यू लाइक टू गिव टू फ्यूचर गेट एस्पिरेंट्स माय एडवाइस टू फ्यूचर एस्पिरेंट्स वुड बी टू माय एडवाइस टू फ्यूचर एस्पिरेंट्स वुड बी टू एक्चुअली फोकस ऑन द कॉन्सेप्ट्स फर्स्ट uh you have to uh take inferences of the subject its concepts from the correct source hamare liye primary source to books the aur sir ka jo interpretation hai un books ka wo aur bas to aapko is pe concepts pe bahut zyada dhyan dena hai kafi cheeze gate matlab kafi cheeze bahut volatile hai kafi wo log uske bahut sare conclusion nikalte hain but uh, there is always a standard book uh, which gives you the correct interpretation to aapko wo find karna bahut zaruri hai aur aur test series ekdam time pe shuru karna hai even though aapka uh, subject uh, preparation uh, syllabus hua hai ya nahi hua hai kyunki syllabus to eventually ho jayega लेकिन अगर आपने टेस्ट सीरीज में लेट कर दिया तो आप बहुत सारे अच्छे क्वेश्चंस को मिस कर दोगे और जो बेटरमेंट का एक टाइम होता है वो किसी 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 का लेट हिट होता है किसी किसी का जल्दी हिट होता है सो यू मे बी अनफॉर्चुनेटली इन द लेटर पार्ट तो अगर आपका टेस्ट uh, सीरीज से जो बेटरमेंट है अगर वो लेट आता है एंड इफ यू स्टार्ट द टेस्ट सीरीज लेट देन इट कुड बी ट्रेबल फॉर यू तो आपको एनालिसिस के लिए टाइम ज़्यादा नहीं मिलेगा सो स्टार्ट योर टेस्ट पेपर्स वेरी अर्ली and uh, don't be afraid of questions so questions humko bahut darate hain jab jo humko nahi aate hain we uh, tend to keep uh, delaying it usko postpone kar rahe hote hain ki hum ye question nahi karenge ye concept abhi chhod dete hain aakhri tak chhod dete hain last mein kar lenge to wo aadat jab kharab ho jati hai to uh, hum aise bahut sare concepts se compromise kar jate hain aur uh, eventually aapko in end mein test series mein malum padta hai aur paper mein bhi malum padta hai ki Uh, ये मुझे पहले पढ़ लेना चाहिए था 
तो यस डोंट कॉम्प्रोमाइज ऑन कॉन्सेप्ट सो दैट वुड बी माई एडवाइस टू द यंग एस्पिरेंट्स थैंक यू नुमेर आई होप योर जर्नी विल इंस्पायर अ लॉट ऑफ फ्यूचर एस्पिरेंट्स थैंक यू थैंक यू